Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the Pennsylvanian toy collector himself. And it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people. And today we'll be reviewing one of my favorite movies from Disney, an animated series, figures from Big Hero 6. But we are going to do a montage with this video, because I like to montage it. <laughs> Ooh, come on, Baymax, stand. <laughs> but first on the... We're going to look at Hiro Hamata, one of the members of Big Hero 6. And he is wearing his cool-looking armor, which is pretty cool. And I dig it. For this figure, I don't know if he had a visor piece that went over his face. But if he had it, I put it on. But otherwise, he looks good good without it. You can actually see his, his eyes are really well painted. His armor is really well painted and sculpted, if I do say so myself. Sure, it doesn't have elbow articulation. Oh, wait. It does have some elbow articulation. Not much, but some. And the head is on a ball joint, which is nice. For an for a Big Hero 6 figure, this is pretty cool. And I love some Big Hero 6. And he even gets bend at the knee? This is a good-looking figure. But we're also reviewing the Big Hero 6 big... Baymax. He doesn't have any articulation because he's basically an armored shell. He doesn't have bend at the knee or elbows, but his arms can go up that far and he could be like Rocket Fist. <laughs> and be like Rocket Fist. Pew. Right at you with the fist. Which is pretty cool for this figure. Except I can't figure out how to launch my rocket fist off this figure. But really good sculpting on superhero Baymax, if I do say so myself. And you get his wings so he can take off and fly. Ain't that cool. You know what you can do with Hero on this figure? You can have him riding Baymax and being like, Come on Baymax, let's go save the day. But he has to be like that to hold on. And he looks like he's flying through the air with Hero. And that's pretty cool. If I do say so myself. But now we're going to compare him next to my original Big Hero 6 Baymax. This one is definitely bigger than the regular size action figure one. Would I highly recommend these figures if you're a Big Hero 6 fan like I became? The moment I saw how cool these figures look? Yes. Pick them up. They are worth it. Add in to your superhero collection. Because Big Hero 6 is superheroes. And I love me some superhero figures. And that's why Baymax is one of my favorites. No matter if he's armored up or if he's being your personal health care companion. And except mine keeps tipping. But now, as soon as we get these Baymaxes standing, we're going to do the montage. Yep. Be time for the montage of the video. In case you're wondering who's making that licking noise, that would be my dog, Teddy. Hey, Teddy. Teddy. Teddy, say hi to the fans. Or lick, or look at the camera. That's my boy, Teddy. He is my dog that sleeps here in the basement with me. And I got the cage door open because he... He doesn't like being locked up in the cage. So I leave the door open if he has to get out. But now, that was Teddy's first guest appearance on the channel. My dog, Teddy. And now, for the musical montage.
And I just love me some superhero figures. I didn't think I'd like the uh, Big Hero 6, the animated series. When I first watched it, I thought it was pretty good. Because I watched the movie from Big Hero 6. But I think it's cool that these scientists from school became superheroes. From tech school became superheroes. Which is awesome. Do I have any plans to add more Big Hero 6 to my collection? Yes, they are awesome. And that's all there is to say for this video. If you like this video, make sure to like, make sure to comment, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. Let's Eddie Hill, moving on and rock on and rock out.